Hey guys, Crypto Foxy here. Thanks so much for stopping by the channel. I've got a couple of big things to talk to you guys about, about the ASI merger that is upcoming here in just two days. Uh, Fetch AI, Singularity Net, uh, AGIX, and Ocean Protocol will be merging to uh, create the new ASI uh, Super Intelligence Alliance. So we're going to talk about uh, some a couple of new developments. I've got some clarification on some of the exchanges, as well as um, a new logo has been released for the project as well. So I just want to uh, get you guys up to date on what is going on. So make sure you smash the like button and jump in and subscribe to my channel as well. Just make sure you guys are staying uh, informed about what is going on. And uh, so let's cover first, we're going to take a look at the logo. And then uh, at the end, I'm going to talk about exchanges as well. I got some clarification in the Telegram, at the Telegram group for Fetch AI today. Day. So I just wanted to share with you my findings. Um, so Fetch AI, Singularity Net, and Ocean Protocol, obviously we know are joining forces, and that is uh, to start in just a few days. So the emblem for ASI reportedly symbolizes the token merger of the three projects, representing the unity of the project's strengths and the draw uh, drawn of a new era in AI. They are combining all the resources, and these projects are set to create a challenge, to have a force to challenge big tech control over AI development. Um, so obviously doing that by decentralization. And the alliance ensures that AI advancements benefit all humankind and not just a select few corporations, right? Um, AI is something that, you know, if, if everybody didn't have access to, it would be a little bit of an unfair advantage to some. So um, they're basically trying to make sure that it is used for uh, some good reasons as well. Um, so let's take a look at the logo. This is it here. Um, so this is the Artificial Super Intelligence Alliance logo. This is newly, re newly released today. I got a, a notification about a tweet today, or a, sorry, a post on X. Um, that they had shared this with their followers. So that's the new logo. So I also have uh, some information regarding exchanges. Um, I know you guys have been, uh, a lot of people have been asking in the, in the questions, uh, in the comment section down and below in the videos, you know, what's gonna happen to my token on such and such an exchange? Well, this is the clarification I got in Telegram. Um, I can't share my screen. It will not allow me to uh, to share it for Telegram, just the software that I'm using, um, but I will read it word for word for you guys. So. I started by saying, for clarification purposes, are you saying that there will not be a list of exchanges supporting the merger? It is up. Is it up to individuals to contact their exchanges themselves? Thanks. That was my question because I, I saw a bunch of people talking about, you know, uh, contact your, they were getting messages back saying, you know, we'll contact your exchange to see if they're going to support it. And some of them haven't said anything yet. Um, and I said, you know, for clarification purposes, is that what you're telling people to do? Or is there like a comprehensive list of exchanges that are supporting it is basically what I wanted to know. Um, so the response I got from uh, Trima, which is uh, sp uh, spelled T-R-E-M-A, and she is the global professional administrator. Um, so she said, no, uh, major relevant exchanges will support the merger. Um, some already made it known that they will support it has been announced by some of them while others are waiting for the right time to announce. I'm assuming we're not going to know until the day of, guys. Um, that's what this is really telling me. She also goes on to say, I believe it's a she, um, also the team has made it known, one of the previously published blogs, that if you hold your token on an exchange, centralized exchange in brackets she has, it will automatically be converted and that no action is required on your end. So if this does come into play and any of you guys do notice that the exchange that you use does not support the merger, um, basically all you'll have to do is transfer your your tokens to a, to a wallet where you hold your own funds. Um, exchanges will never just say, okay, we don't support this anymore and sorry, but you lost all your money. That's, that's just not the way it works, right? They'll usually give you a date, you know, we'll give you until this date for you to transfer your tokens out of our exchange kind of thing and uh, kind of move on from there, right? Um, so, you know, if, if that were to occur, that's the worst case scenario for you guys. Otherwise, um, they're going to most likely support it. She said, you know, any of the major relevant exchanges are most likely going to support it. I did hear talks today about KuCoin uh, being added to that list that uh, another um, customer had basically reached out to them and said, hey, are you guys supporting it? And they came back and said, yes. So, you know, uh, what happens with, you know, long positions and things like that, if your exchanges support, um, you know, leverage trading and things, we're not quite sure what's going to happen there. It's going to be individual, you know, exchange by exchange, right? So as I said before, you know, I wouldn't open any new long positions or short positions or anything like that. Don't open any new positions. 
But if you have tokens on the exchange and they happen to not support it, which sounds like most of them right now are going to, um, you might just have to move them off to a wallet. Not really a big deal, right? Um, or, you know, sell them, whatever. Uh, I'm sure every exchange is going to most likely make some kind of a post or uh, communication to that effect if they're going to be supported or not. Um, otherwise, you might just you know, get up and, and open up your wallet and see, or your exchange wallet and see that it's just been swapped to ASI. So that's the best case scenario. That's most likely what's going to happen with a lot of them. But I will be here, guys, to let you guys know what to do if anything happens that you're just not sure of. Um, just stay tuned to my channel. I'll obviously be covering this in great detail. Um, I'll let you guys know if I find any major exchanges that are not going to support it, which I have not yet. So that's good news. So I'll catch you guys in the next video. Please stay tuned and uh, stick around. I will be covering this merger all the way through and uh, we'll, we're in it together, guys. So uh, I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.